Today, we are going to be reforming Axis Germany in Age of History 2. Now, if you don't know what Axis Germany is, it's basically Nazi Germany. And basically, what we're going to have to do is that we're going to have to invade Poland, get Kaliningrad, this to uh, grab this one spot in Lithuania, to grab, to, to, to create the, to create the, uh, the Weimar Republic. And we're going to do this with these options. So we're going to have a AI aggressive down, fog of war, classic, normal war. We don't need anything else, but we do not need sandbox mode because that is cheating. All right, let's start. So I guess the first thing we can do is get a bit into taxation. I feel like that's the first thing you gotta do. Drop five into research, drop like four into five into upkeep, no it's six, and then drop one into population growth. Now we have a giant amount of this, so we're just gonna bring it up to the cap. We're gonna bring this down. We're gonna also bring this back down to here. So we got a nice amount of supplies. So I guess the first thing we can do is start building castles and and watchtowers. Now if you don't know what castles or watchtowers do, they basically watchtowers show what troops are on the border and fortresses slash castles. Um, hide the amount of troops you have despite having even if they have a uh, castle or something like that but I guess the first thing we could do is attempt to uh, build up so the first thing we got to do is the Weimar Republic we have to get the we have to get we have to get this part of Poland Gotta get these parts of Poland. Gotta gra grab Kaliningrad and this one spot from Lithuania. So I guess the first thing we should start doing is start afford starting up an army. Now we must we must keep the treasury in. in yeah, sorry about that. Sorry about that. <laughs> I accidentally closed out. But anyway, we have to. What we have to do is that we're gonna have to have like troops along the borders of every country. Now, if you may you may ask why. It's to stop any country or see ahead if a country is planning to invade. Invade, cause um, we do not want to get invaded when we're already invading a country. Oh, and just one thing to know: I, I this this version of Modern World does have the original United States. Unlike, oh yeah, by the way, nice quick thing to note that this thing is this guy is in, this video is inspired by a. By a mapping video guy who, who made a video about reforming the, the German Empire, so I'm just making this on uh, putting this about uh, a specific uh, Germany. But yeah, it's inspired by him. So who do I do I not have good relations? Okay, I'm gonna have to place um, watchtowers and castles around France. Oh yeah, that's a problem. Yeah, they got they got troops on the border. That's so really bad thing to note. That's really bad. Build castle. All right, now that we have that set up, I'm just gonna place um. We're gonna have troops set up on the border. Now, one thing we have to do is keep the population keep the population going up. Now, I suppose the first thing we'll have to do is um uh, start getting a navy. So uh. So we're gonna recruit some troops here. So now we're gonna send these troops into the border, into the ocean. So now we just need to recruit a few more troops. And we have to quickly um, make this quick because uh, we have a big military and the bigger the military, uh, how do I make this clear? The bigger the military, the the less the amount of uh, the problematic amount of how do I put this together? The amount, the more military you have, it, the more the more money is spent 
Oh, but yeah, I have bad relations with, uh, with, uh, with Denmark. I gotta place a castle. I have to place a watchtower. Oh, man, I gotta, I gotta raise taxes. I may have to raise taxes. Alright, let's try to get on good terms with these guys. Maybe, maybe if I can, start an alliance. Yeah, they have troops set up, so I guess, yeah, alliance. Aha, yes, I have alliance with these guys. Okay. So, we don't need troops along these borders now. Because it's highly unlikely that they're gonna, that they will go to war with you when they're in alliance. Okay, that's, that's, that, that's a problem. That's problematic. So, we're gonna have tr troops there. So, basically, what we're gonna do is we're just gonna prepare for war. Uh, yeah, let's start preparing for war by uh, recruit more troops and... I mean, honestly, all we gotta do is do some touch landings, and then we're good. All right, let's start start marching into Poland. Now this is a crazy strategy because now we have to march into Poland and and take out most of their troops. So now we're gonna just straight up march into Poland. I don't know how many times we're gonna say that march into Poland. All right, now that we're in Poland, we all we have to do is just take the capital, which the capital it's not like the original, unlike actual unlike the original age of history uh, age of history 2 has this weird system where where unlike other unlike other uh actual wars when you take out the capital not the entire the entire country will not fall you will still have to fight a a a cap a uh a uh cap capitalist capitalist country which is which is um pretty easy to be honest very easy to conquer uh, oh no oh no oh no berlin's dying berlin is gonna die yeah we lost berlin now we are now we are much screwed no while we're at it we should call for uh, aid This is the problem. When you lose your capital, you're basically just doomed. So I'm gonna call. I'm gonna call. So I'm gonna call Belgium and Netherlands to help. Cause this is gonna be a problematic scenario. All right, now that we have reconquered, now that we've conquered Berlin again. We have to spend all our money on uh, recruitment. See, it's the problem. Now, now that we're being invaded. It's, it's o only time will tell when, when we're eventually conquered and annexed by Poland. All right, now that we've cut off their troops, um, we are, we can easily, oh, okay, we lost Berlin again. Uh, yes, the troops are recall coming back. The troops are coming, okay. Yes, I'm so glad we called, we called arms. Well, we gotta march up taxes. Drop that, drop that. Yeah, we gotta drop a lot of tax. Okay, we've reconquered Berlin. Oh my god. Oh my god. I have so m less movement points. Yeah, I'm definitely gonna die. Bit to pushing back oh no okay we're probably gonna we're probably gonna die all I need is this Warsaw pact <laughs> all right we've reconquered Berlin again oh my how do they have so many troops last time I played in normal mode in normal mode oh my god I should play in beginner mode I'm just gonna I don't play in beginner mode. Yeah, but the thing is, um, when your army is split apart, 
um, it can lead to um, complete. It, when your army is split apart from the mainland, um, it will result in death of your army. Okay, this is starting to get. This is starting to get problematic. But now we have taken out most of the capital. Now it's now we can push in to the mainland. As long as they don't have any allies. Now we gotta focus our troops into pushing into the main building. Into the main Poland. Alright, as you can see, um, invasion is not going well. But hey, anything can turn around. But hey, uh, problems can turn around, right? Problematic things can turn around. See, now now that we've lost... Okay, okay, that's problematic. But basically, how the game works is that you have you own... You basically... this The game is basically about managing your... Managing an army and a country. And if you want to go to war, you can go to war. But the problem is, you will be invaded. One way, shape, or form, you will be invaded. And as invasions go, they tend to be pretty problematic. But since that army is split off from the mainland, which just got reconnected to the mainland, we can basically push through I'm out of movement points see I already have this top part of the of the YMR Republic so But this invasion is is turning out really badly. See, this is why invasions can get really bad. <laughs> now, can we just look at this diplomacy? Look at this. Just look at it. We're at war with Poland. Poland is pushing in through here. They don't even look like the same as they did back in the... I don't know what time it was. Alright, all we gotta do is push forward straight in. Just go straight in. And if you guys ever comment sus, we have a problem. See, now we are pushing in Poland. Now this is where th their tables turn. This is where Germany turns the tables. All we gotta do is continuously march into Poland to the point where they surrender and we win. Alright, we're nearing Warsaw. We are nearing their capital. Oh no, that's where that's where the tables turn. For us. Now, how can we uh, fix this problem? Attic scenario. Well, we must remember one thing Mozart or something said. I don't know. It's it's made up. Uh, what he said was, "This is made up. Don't do it." When you invade a country, don't don't not have a plan. That's 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 what he said. Don't forget, don't forget to don't forget to have a plan. That's what that's what he said. On quotes, on quotes. When you invade a country, don't forget to have a plan. All right, we're gonna have to send uh, troops into the mainland, into Poland. We're gonna have to reconnect a lot of this. The hell? Yeah, sorry about that. Yes, for some reason my thing closed. But hey, we're doing well so far. Um, we gotta recruit more troops. 
Yeah, but basically this is how this is gonna play out. We're gonna we're gonna invade and we're gonna get pushed back. We're gonna invade and then get pushed back. Invade, push back. Invade, push back. It's basically I honestly thought I was gonna die at first, but Poland's definitely gonna die. This is how we win. This is how we finished our Polish invasion. This is how our Polish invasion goes well. <laughs> um, technically, this is how it's gonna go well. We gotta push soldiers directly into the capital. How is Denmark doing? They still have troops. I don't think I need to recruit troops. But now we have to push troops in here. Make your landing. I I have I just need uh just some of this area. Let me look at what I need. So I need this, this, the and this. Okay. So in the end, I'm gonna have to conquer these, this, and this from Poland. If that makes sense. All right, this is starting to go. This is starting to get intense. Uh, I'm so glad there's music playing in the background, or if I forgot to add music. All right, let's see how this plays out. Okay, we're continuously marching directly into Poland. They are definitely going to collapse. We have enough money to go by. They just lost all their troops there. That's that's a that's good for us because we may have lost our troops, but they lost. But they, that area is undefended. Now we've reached them. All right, now that area is locked off. Now we all we gotta do is march directly in. Warsaw is under threat now. Huh. Province is not supplied. Where's the province? Yeah, looks like all of the land is kind of being taken. Man, this invasion is actually going well after I thought it was hopeless. Now this is where we turn the tables. We gotta, we gotta move the troops directly to Warsaw. Now this is how we turn the tables. If the tables weren't already turned. Now here we are. Poland is actually a good is a good advantage because we can just straight up push directly in into uh. Poland actually has a good strategic strategic good advantage. They have a really good advantage. Just just dumb down. They have a really good advantage because because they have Warsaw. So we're actually going to plunder Warsaw, which will add to our treasury if our treasury wasn't empty enough. Actually, it's not that empty at all. Yeah, but now that Poland is basically just full on dead. Yeah, that 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 that's hard to that's weird to look at. So as we continue our full scale invasion, which will probably end horribly. Yeah, look at that. Look at that. That's 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 the t smell of good. So now here's the problem: if they get their capital back, back they can they can hard they can hard supply troops. But yeah, but at the same time, we're gonna have to use diplomacy and get on the good side. Oh yeah, Vladimir Putin. <laughs> they already they already got Ukraine. Damn. Wait, what's this? Transnistria. Communist? Oh. oh yeah, I edited Modern World. Yeah, I remember that now. Yeah, I ended up making it Modern World to countries that aren't supplied, that aren't recognized by the UN. All right, we have reconquered. We, we have kept the capital extremely safe. The capital is extremely safe now. The province is unsupplied. What province? 
Oh, I think I know what it is. Yeah, I think we have to connect the actual troops to the actual... Wait, okay, that's weird. Yeah, now we have a fully unsupplied province. Now, here we are. We are connect reconnected and we are pushing directly through. All right, we are in Poland. We are in the full, we're in full scale. We took them out, boys. We have taken Poland. Oh my God, I feel so happy now. <laughs> I feel happy, I feel happy. All right, now I'm gonna start to supply Poland. Now I'm gonna start to take back what I, take the German spirit again. Okay, so in the end, we actually can't take the entirety of Poland. But if it wasn't for these guys, we'd, we'd be good. If it wasn't for these, if it wasn't for, for, um, Netherlands and, and, uh, what's their name, uh, Belgium, we'd be borderline screwed. So now, in the end, we've conquered this. Damn. Ah, oh, man. Well, hopefully we can try to resupply by building more castles because we're gonna actually have to go back to war with Poland Well, I will be back after all of the war settles back in But there's no physical way that they're gonna try and invade this time. How's France? How's how's our relations with France? We need to sign a non-aggression but you, Italy. I have bad relations with every country around. Um, how about we? Uh, okay, we can't do that. But hey. Okay, let's try and move the the guys that were in war back. Oh yeah, we gotta. This is how we uh, stop with the re rebel revelations, but yeah, yeah, I will be back with when the uh, when this war is completed, when when we complete when we completely get what we want out of Poland. Oh damn, diseases! What do we have? This is cro oh my god, coronavirus! Oh my god, coronavirus is everywhere! Coronavirus is everywhere! Oh my god, coronavirus is everywhere! <laughs> Except for Berlin. Okay, so I'll be back. So, uh, I did not think that I, that I'd start recording after, during this, uh, during your, your little wait, but, um, Belgium and the Netherlands are at war with France, so might as well join in. Oh, shit. Yeah, I think that was a terrible idea. Yes, a terrible idea. So, um, may the force be with you. May the force be with you. All I, all I want is this spot. All I want is this little land spot. Well, um, all we gotta do is continue our invasion into France. Oh no, what are you guys doing? What are you doing? All I want is this land. Oh my god, we need, we need Vicky France again. <laughs> Oh no. Don't die, Belgium! I don't need a death! I don't need to lose Belgium! This, are dead. this is terrible. This is gonna end terribly. I almost skipped a turn. I almost went, next, went to next turn. Alright, Belgium, you're doing well so far. Surprisingly. All right, we are marching directly to France once again. Man, this is starting to get, I'm starting to get deja vu. Ha, 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 ha. I'm getting a lot of deja vu. Yeah, I feel, I feel, I feel, I feel that this is very familiar. I don't know where, we have taken out, we have taken Paris. Oh, sh did I just? Okay, man, we don't, we can just forget about this little mis- miscommunication okay we just we just we just 
we just killed uh we just killed Spanish troops. Okay, that may they may not they may not deny they may deny that peace treaty, but uh Okay, we have taken most of France and we're gonna continue our invasion. I said we could call out peace. We could just call out peace, bro. We we we're we're chill, right? We're still chill. Well, if they don't want to, we could just call their we could just call our allies. Okay, we gotta send more troops in. Yep, they do not want that. They want to go back to war. So I guess we gotta call their allies. We gotta call allies. Oh, what a predicament this is! We're in Italy. Oh my God, Italy's now. We we can get on good terms with Italy now. Oh man, we're gonna get some a lot of deja vu from this one. I never thought I'd go to war with with France again. Now please, let's not die. Let's not die, please. Yeah, Spain is uh yeah, Spain has made a few mistakes. All right, we're going to go to uh we're heading to All right. Now, all we got to do is set an ultimatum to uh you just 29,000 troops will evade if you do not give us this. Yep, and we have completely annexed them. And we have lost troops too. Then we're losing troops, and we're gonna lose troops too. Okay, we got Paris, we got Paris, we got Paris. This is insanity. This invasion is going so well. Oh my god. How is this going t to end, I wonder? I don't know how long the video is be. It's gonna probably be 20 minutes, so, um... Oh, great! Span Span has entered the chat. <laughs> Alright, you quit your movement. We're going to France. We're going back to the French. Alright, all we gotta do now is split France in half. Splitting France in half. What, what's the worst that can happen? All we gotta do is release wiki France. <laughs> oh, I guess. Ugh. Uh, nope. That that plan of of cutting France in half is ending. It has ended. But we can take out most. All right. Let's see what we have so far. Yep, we're at war with two sides. Um, might as well just call for peace, honestly. Yeah, that's all I want. <laughs> and you? I don't want anything out of you. Damn it. Can we at least be at peace? Or else I'll support, I'll support your rebels. I'm supporting the rebels now. Now, where are the troops in else at? Alright, we gotta go to Italy and request for, um, military access. Because it's gonna be difficult to maneuver around with Italy in the picture. But man, this is uh, turning into a really, really good full-scale invasion. Might as well get, um... Let's both get military access. If... You declare war on France. Let's let's see how that plays out. Did they agree to that, or did they not? Okay, we have Italy did not. They want get one. yes, but please, Italy. Let's uh, get yeah, yeah, yeah. They don't let us get it, military access, but we will give them military access. It's gonna end really horribly. All right, guys, I'll be back. Update with the Spain war. I've taken the capital. All right, cutting back to off-camera invading. The war with Spain has finally ended. 
And we, I also set up uh, Catalonia, and uh, Belgium got some lands back. But anyway, we have to now. We have to go back to the war with. Uh, now we have to reinvade Poland. Oh sh! Actually, that's good because we could actually take a uh, part Kaliningrad. Are you kidding me? No, like, seriously, are you kidding me? Military access with Poland. With Poland. right now alliance with Poland mm. sorry sorry I'm getting really mad actually with Poland out of all countries Poland Actually, that is pure anger. This is pure anger. Let's agree. Take a little grab. We're done. <gasps> how about how about this? If you think you're so cool, if you think you're so cool, if you think you're so cool. Oi, Libya. Everybody, declare war on Russia. Maybe I'll have to think twice. Oh, yeah, by the way, Poland. Declare war on Russia. Kazakhstan. Declare war on Russia. I want Russia gone off the map. Oh, what the hell happened to the United States? Okay, anyway. You... Declare war in Russia. Not, not once in my life did I ever get so mad at Russia. Or did I ever think I'd get mad at Russia. All I want is Kaliningrad. Agree to peace. Sha. Why are so many people? Yeah. Ha ha ha! Yeah, Russia's gotta think twice. Yo, give me Kalinin Grad and we're done. Why are you denying peace? Oh. I gotta complete this video later. I'm thinking of taking a. Maybe maybe I'll resume this video tomorrow, but no, I can't do that. Why does Poland have so many troops?
How is Russia's invasion? Yeah, a lot of troops are stepping in. Man, Mexico's really having a field day. Is that Montana? Well, oh, Russia's getting a, what I can presume to be a full invasion. Now they're completely empty. All right, for now, I'm gonna complete this later. I'm gonna do this work later, okay? Guys, I'll do this work later and I'll be back. Okay guys, I just returned from uh from what I was up to before, but we are back. I just returned from my little break. It was a nice break. Okay, anyway. We are continuing our invasion into Poland. Oh great. Okay, we are already gangstered. Alright, we're already have nor we're already at northern Poland, so we're chilling. Maybe if we're like lucky, like extremely lucky, we could try and like push through Poland. We could try, try to at least. All right, let's see how this plays out. All right, marching through Poland. All right, we have one troop left. We have one set of troop troops left there. Oh. Well, um, I'm certainly not stressed anymore, but but I can try to call a peace with Russia by right, taking Kaliningrad. All I need from Russia is just Kaliningrad. Not that bad. But we will keep marching into into, um, do I conquer it? No, I do not. Oh no, that's gonna suck. Alright, time to, time to fill in my tragical obligation, which is not an advert. My tragical ob obligation is, we are not going to invade Russia. That was Germany's first mistake. That was Germany, one of Germany's only mistakes in World War II. Invading Russia. Invading Russia was Germany's only mistake. One of Germany's only mistakes. <laughs> Let's see if we can cut Poland in half. Huh. Let's try it at least. Let's meet up with the troops and and all I need is just a few specs. All right, they already got their capital back. All right, taking back. We cut Poland in half, so we're in the clear for now. Mm. Oh no! Oh no! That's not good. Russia, can we agree to take just Kaliningrad? We only need Kaliningrad. Oh, great. Oh my god, we finally got peace with Russia! Huh! Alright. 
All right, now that we got Kaliningrad after multiple uh, attempts at agreements. All right, what do I need now? All right, peace with Poland. All right, validation. Demand validation, and I'm gonna take a bit. Yeah, I'm just gonna take that. Yeah, I'm just gonna make a, a better one. Yep. And the YMR Republic cannot be formed yet. Uh, well, not at war with Lithuania. But hey, at least my attempt at angering Russia kind of went my way. Yeah, Russia's kind of screwed. <laughs> Man, what happened to what happened to Belarus? Man, Russia's still at war with these people. Who who is who's this? Norway. Oh man, really sucks for them. That <laughs> sucks to be them at least. All right, I I've turned Poland into mini Poland after World War Two. All we gotta do now is just start to prepare your troops at the border. I wonder what's going on with my allies. I hope the allies are doing good. Yeah, they're just chilling. Um, what alliances can we form right now? Man, there's man, the United States is really getting bald. Well, let's see if they get destroyed. I'm gonna focus on this one thing. I'm gonna focus on New York. Oh, United States lost their uh, capital. Let's see how they die. Boston. Man, the United States is really turning into a united Greenland. Oh. <laughs> All right. Anyway, anyway, we're continuing. I have, I have liberated Poland. That's funny. Liberating Poland. All right. Who can we? Uh, oh, make an alliance with? Oh my God, Czechoslovakia. I uh, know you're not Czechoslovakia. Czechs. It's the Czechs. It's the Czechs. And now let's move troops over here. Um, one, two, three. Man, what's going on with them? Taxation. Spend a bit of money. Oh yeah, look at that inflation. Inflation. Okay, so what do I gotta do? I am going to gift the uh, my. Uh, I'm gonna give them some money. Oh, I'm in debt. I'm in severe debt. All right, no, I'm no longer in debt. Okay, now declare war and enter. Declare war and enter. Declare war on Lithuania. March directly into, into them. Just enter in. Show them the German spirit. <laughs> Show them the good old German spirit. Oh god, we're definitely. But yeah, they, I bet. Oh wait, man, I love my troops. All right, all we need now is this one spot of land to form the Weimar Republic. Now I want the station. Oh, station. And now we have two more colonies. That means I'm gonna have to kill my relations with Poland if I want this one land. This 
Here, I'll pay them this amount of money if they kill us this world province. That means I'm gonna have to drop relations. Should I just demand annexation? I'm just gonna demand demand one province. Okay. Man, even the vassal doesn't doesn't want. We're gonna have some troops in the middle so we can so we can try to look strong in front of Poland. Sorry about that. Anyway, but anyway, um, um, what we gotta do right now is we gotta get some stuff done. Oh my God, what? I'm surprised some nations are still are still like one. Does that make sense? Sudan call, uh, declare war on South Sudan. I want to see this play out. I want to be abused. Okay. Yep. South Sudan is more south southern than is more south than before. All right. Cuba. Yeah. Sure. Yeah, that just that just goes to uh, war. Then I'm just gonna say peace. May the force be with you. <laughs> May the force be with you. I sent another ultimatum. Just to be full annexation. I did not expect that. I swear to god I did not expect that. Oh my god, what happened to Russia? Oh my god. I got I got more enemies. I didn't have more enemies. Yes, Slovakia. Go to right, Weimar Republic. We have the Weimar Republic after like I don't know how long. We could form the German Empire. Oh my God. I mean, we can do that and say we're done and say I'm done, but I don't want to do that. Okay, so anyway, we have to get something really straight, straight going right now. I need to invade the Czech Czech Republic. I need to invade Czechoslovakia, the new Czechoslovakia. So I'm gonna move all my troops down to the border. We're gonna move all the troops to the border. Yeah, that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna get the weaker flank. We're gonna call up the weaker flank. So yeah, we're gonna invade Czechoslovakia. Do not ask. All right. Where are they? Uh, we have. Oh yeah, we gave military access to them. You know, technically, I can just go to. No, 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 not that. We can't just do change type of government. <laughs> but no, that's cheating. I need, like, actual fascist, uh, Germany. So I'm gonna step directly into, um, Austria. And state, this is Germany. And bada bing, bada boo. Oh, sh And bada bing, bada boom. This is gonna be German. Austria, Germany. <laughs> Austria, uh, Austrian Germany. All right, we have one part of Austria done. We are close. We are. Yes, we are almost there. We are almost there to ending the video.
Okay, move the troops down over here. Now demand you give us this land. Like right now. Okay, you said no? Okay, all okay troops. Get ready to enter. And of course, we don't have enough troops to go by. And everyone is marching back inside. Back inside. Everyone's marching back, marching inside the Czech Republic. Man, I'm getting more deja vu. <laughs> Okay, so that's ending. This this invasion's gonna end poorly. Oh man, we're we're doomed. Yeah, sorry, I'm, I'm quiet. Yeah, I'm just a bit quiet when I'm when I'm focused. All right. Hopefully, this isn't this video isn't too long, so because I feel really bad for the people that just came to watch. Watch and have to wait 20 minutes just to see me form Nazi Germany. <laughs> Kind of funny. We did it! We invaded! We invaded them! <laughs> we invaded Czechoslovakia! This looks like so wrong. We need the Rhine! Men, we need the Rhine! We need the Rhine! We got them, boys! We got the entirety of the Czech Republic. Let's go, okay. All right, let's uh, see. Yep, we can form Germany. Yep. Oh, we do not need this much, but... Germany, yes, we invaded. Uh, we, uh, we have turned to access Germany. But guys, thank you so much for watching. Uh, what was that? What was that? No, no, no. I don't know what just happened, but thank you so much for watching. Comment, like, and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video. Oh my god, this is so, this is so much. This is so much land. I have to grab for the Greater German Reich. Alright, anyway, um, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure to comment, like, and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.